Okay, so I'm upstairs now. That's looking down. There's four full bathrooms in this house, which with a bunch of little girls, that's a good thing. The rooms are pretty big. Um, I don't have the dimensions, but if you kind of count the sheets of plywood, that gives you a good idea. I think this has, this has nine foot ceilings, right? Up here, these nines. So there's two full baths on this upstairs hallway. That's a bedroom. Clearly that's a bedroom. Nice big laundry room. Um, they're pretty good about putting these windows in the laundry room, which I think the amount of time we spend in the laundry room, that's a good thing. And so far, all of the bedrooms are balanced. So even though it's six bedrooms, you're not getting a tiny bedroom anywhere. Double window. So far, we've hit three bedrooms upstairs and one downstairs, just so you can kind of keep track. And like I said, this isn't my favorite builder over here that I've sold the most of. So coming down here, this is a two kid room all day long or a media room just an opinion um this room is bigger than most masters if you look at the width of the plywood going across that's a big room um it's kind of hard to tell when they're vacant but this is what you're looking at outside there's only gonna there's one house right there and then that's it there's an older house over this way and then there'll be one behind and one there. There's a good look at the backyard from upstairs.